careful masturbation. Welcome to another episode of Serialist Business. Matt's on along with <laughs> Nando. But you're like the cat. Don't make me throw you on the couch. I'm doing the fucking puzzle. I don't give a shit if you're doing the puzzle. Do it. I was doing done. the puzzle by just Bad staring at it like with this. Nando I didn't have to pick it up. And Chuck Rowland. We have two new variations on classic cereals. Two of my all-time favorites. Uh, we've got Tropical Fruit Loops and Honey Clover Lucky Charms. Um, what did you? What are you guys growing up? What were you guys? All right, just. No, uh, Lucky Charms yeah. was a <laughs> Cocoa Puffs. My favorite. I do like. Um, There's too many. I give up. I do like. Uh, Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Another one right there. And as we're filming this, it's fall. My all time favorite, Count Chocula's out. We good? All right, so what do you guys oh, think about right <laughs> Lucky Charms and Fruit Loops? Uh, I, I hate it and I don't like it. I actually think that I liked Fruit Loops a little more than Lucky Charms. Fruit Loops was my ultimate dry cereal besides uh, Cinnamon Toast I Crunch. I like Fruit Loops better than Fruity Pebbles. Fruity Pebbles suck dick, yeah. The texture on them, the moment, I've always said, when the moment milk touches them, they just turn yeah. to slop. Yeah. But they also, there was a reformulation of the flavor at one point, that's what made them taste worse. Uh, but both of them are great, so I'm I'm more curious about the Lucky Charms variation than uh, the Tropical yeah. Fruit Loops. But yeah, you're right though, Count Chocula is always the shit. I always get at least one box every year just yeah. to try it, so. All right, which one do you guys want to try first? Let's try with the shit. Let's go with the one that we know will be safe. Okay, say. good. <laughs> I was about to say. I do think that. that's the questionable one. I thought you were going to blow your load quick. <laughs> I just don't like... Never. Look at the colors of the cereal in this one. They don't look very appealing at all. No. Like yellow, orange, and green. That's like that's like a yeast infection on a homeless person. <laughs> that smells... Go I bang, smell like Starburst. Go bang, go, go bang, oh, bang, go no, that's too much. Go bang, go. All right, let's go in dry. dry. Wow, that smells terrible. Yep. Oh my god. That doesn't even smell like Fruit Loops. It just smells like fucking like, like candy. Oh. That's not good. They taste like Pez. Yeah. Uh, yeah. They taste better than they smell. It's not nearly as offensive. They definitely. Oh, that yellow one's disgusting. Yeah, yellow one's gross. You didn't try. You didn't go dry. I did go dry. You just didn't see me do it. That yellow one is. Never mind. That sounds bad. The... No, it's okay. You're Asian. You can say it. Oh, cool. <laughs> I hate the yellow. All right. Dude, Fruit Loops. I just, I remember, like, my mom buying me a full box. I would just eat the whole fucking thing while I was playing video games. <laughs> Let's see if this disgusting smelling <laughs> tastes okay. Mmm. That's just making me want regular Fruit Loops. Mm-hmm. That yellow one is so mm -hmm. brown and disgusting. It's sour. It's like a sour Fruit Loops. It's like an old banana. One banana. Sex. Uh, I, think, was open I think pineapple comes out more. Mm. There's not. There is a pineapple flavor. The thing is, with limited time versions of like classics, is it's got to be better than the classic. Mm -hmm. If it isn't, I'm just gonna want the classic. Like, no, nah, this is this is a big old yeah. fail. In other words, it's better than both of those coffee cereals we did last time. No way. It was yeah. better than that last coffee one. Mm. It's just it just tastes off. Uh, I'm gonna give it like a very, very uh, high three out of five. Like it's all right, but regular Fruit Loops get a, get a seal of approval. I mean, regular Fruit Loops are just one of the best series of all time. So just a fail. Uh, I give it a low one. It's not a it. It's not wow. as good as the original Fruit Loops. It's it's like night and day. That's uh, definitely a one. I don't like that at all. That's racist. <laughs> Let's go. This one I have high hopes for. This sounds delicious. Yeah. Because one of the problems with Lucky Charms is that the dry portion always tasted like meh. Yeah. But well, the marshmallow cardboard are box. So if they improve upon the flavor of the dry yeah. portion, then oh, I'm in. And I love honey being added. And give to it, stuff. give it kind of like a honey nut Cheerios type taste to it. Wait, doesn't smell like anything. And it's General Mills. I mean, them and Honey Nut Cheerios are the same. These limited time cereals are such bullshit though, because they always they have to make you buy oh, the large wow. one. That's really good. I think it's gonna be awesome, man. This is gonna be a problem, too. I'm gonna be high one night and I'm just gonna be like, oh, I'm gonna go to flavor country. Oh. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's try it dry first. Mmm. Kinda tastes alcoholic, too. What's going on? I, I taste like there's some booze in there. Not to me, that's fucking good. A little. Right? There's like a, a weird... hint of booze. There's something going on with that flavor. But at least the, um,. Cereal pieces are more solid than the regular. Mmm, with the milk. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh man, that is real good. Mm -hmm. well, what's nice is it's a distinct enough flavor from regular Lucky Charms that I'm not like wanting the original. Texture on it's nice too. It's got a nice, really nice. What the syrup uh, pieces taste like? Have you had O's? Mm -hmm. That's what the cereal pieces taste mm -hmm. like. Mm. Oh, it's another classic. Yeah, oh, those are delicious. Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Um, oh, um, Honey Nut Cheerios. I'm trying to think of more that I had as a kid that I really liked. But, I, man, I was definitely a cereal kid. I do not touch cereal at all as an adult. When, I, when we do it on the show, that's it. It's just not worth it. Like, when you look at the stats on the side, you're better off eating a fucking candy bar. Mm. No, I don't think it's as good as regular Lucky Charms. Because I think you made a good point. This is like a syrupy version, whereas the uh, regular Lucky Charms is marshmallow version. Yeah. It's still really good. I'm gonna give this one a very high four out of five. <laughs> and season, I did the same thing I did as a kid. I picked out all the marshmallows. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. It's a four out of five. Not as solid as the original, but it's it is a lot better than the Fruit Loops. Yeah, for sure, a four out of five. That's pretty damn good. I can't wait until they do uh, the new Cinnamon Toast Crunch flavor. It's a pussy, mm. pussy toast crunch. <laughs> I bet you if you went to a you porn are, shop... You are three for three today. Yeah, I'm pretty good. I bet you if you went to a porn shop, they would definitely sell pussy toast crunch, though. Have you ever been to a porn shop before? Yeah. Yeah. It's always... It always is damp. It's so weird. Like, you, you smile because you know I'm right. That's it's what, always like... What, the moment you walk in, there's no airflow. It's damp. And the guy working the register is always creepy. Always fucking creepy. The one time that I went in with Chris, it was back in the day when we did porn on the cob, and we go in there, and it's the creepy dude working, and these two, like, moms, and they're just sitting there commenting about how this, like, dildo's so big. They're like, oh, that's really big. We're like, what is happening right now? This is so weird. <laughs> what world am I in? It's very strange. Kids, if you're watching this, cereal's great, and uh, ignore what a dick is. Don't worry about it. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, favorite cereal of all time? Let us know in the comments down below. I, I mean, I'm Count Chocolate, hands down. Yeah, Cocoa Here's Puff. It. Yeah, Cocoa Puffs are good. Cocoa Krispies uh, were good as well. I think we made a wrong turn. Yeah, I don't oh, know where I'm going. Oh, oh no! <laughs> Come on. All right, I'm getting the fucking crucifix out. Get that crucifix out, even though it won't do anything. Scooby we learned nothing before. from that. We learned it was no, 21. No, she responded. Oh! Oh! That's dead. Ah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>